Were you uh, playing in the, in the first set, both of your serves seemed to be on? I mean, at some point in your mind, are you waiting for the other guy's serve to dry up? I'm, I'm waiting for the opportunity. I know I have a lot of belief in my serve. I know, I know how, how hard it is to break me. I know how much and how well I can take care of my serve against anybody. So um, I believe that gives me an edge mentally as well and just puts more pressure on my opponent. So I wait for that opportunity and I was able to make the most of it in the second set. If you and Kubashek get to the final, I would imagine that would be a milestone, some kind of historical thing. Do you ever think about stuff like that before the fact? No. Um, I follow what Kubashek does, but uh, and I, I want him to do well, but at the same time, I'm just so caught up in sort of what I need to do, what my recovery process is from here to the next match. And there's still a lot of tennis for both of us to be played. He's He's got four sets uh, to win to get there, I got two, so a lot can happen in those times, but I definitely would want that to be a scenario, and hopefully this week, and if not this week, maybe in the future. Yeah, uh, thanks. Um, you're surging, Vashik's surging, Jeannie's surging, even though, though she's not here this week, you're, you're all headed home uh, in a couple of days. Tell me how important uh, Rogers is and its star players are to Tennis Canada and Canadian tennis fans, and also, is there any added pressure when you go to Rogers? Um, there is added pressure, but for myself, because it's, I would say it's probably the most important tournament to me outside of the four, mass, the four slams where I want to do well. But at the same time, it's, it's not really a pressure because I've been fortunate enough to play best, my best tennis in Canada. So um, I look forward to it. And obviously it's great to have Canadians doing well and um, you want them to do well. It, it just helps the sport beyond professional levels, more so on the aspect of just growing the sport, maybe more kids getting involved. I have a super serious question. There was a long debate on the ESPN commentary booth about your computer, uh, saying you have the best hair at ATP, um, and comparing you with uh, putting you up there with Fernando Verdasco. What are your thoughts on that? Good? <laughs> <laughs> Talk about pressure. Yeah. Um, is that weird for you? Which part? That's, that, that's a serious topic on ESPN. <laughs> maybe, maybe if we talked about other things, they'd tell us tennis more on ESPN. <laughs> yeah. Well, do you feel your hair is special? <laughs> I tried to make it special, not just for myself, for the viewers as well. <laughs>